decided to invite you for us to have an interactive session in view of the forthcoming elections in both Edo and on those states. Therefore, the objective of this meeting is to share knowledge and compare notes, especially as regards to our previous experiences in election security in Nigeria. And I hope we shall have discussion on key indicators on election security threats, especially arming a movement of political thoughts, use of inciting statements during political campaigns, the, lack, the high likelihood of violence and possible cross-attack by political opponents, and the issue of misinformation and disinformation aimed at heating up the polity, and we could also deliberate on effort at uh, the digitalizing government institutions involved in the electoral process, trying to give them negative uh, uh, report or assessment. Um, on our part, what are we already doing? We've done a lot. We've deployed um, uh, our intelligence outfits for them to generate security, I mean, trade analysis, which could be used to sustain our processes of uh, the election in both states. We, do, we, we send them, they are doing trade analysis to know those areas that will require action before the, the election day, especially those that are likely to cause problems um, on the day of the elections for us to take action before then. Um, in view of the nature of what we've been hearing already coming out from Edo, where the main political parties, the two political fight, um, parties are there fighting themselves, violence, movement of arms and ammunition here and there, we've change our deployment strategy from what we wanted to do. We have now escalated to a level that we believe will help us conduct the election uh, so that a free and fair election can take place and uh, a level playing field is created for everybody to vote whoever they want to vote. Um, so we've escalated our uh, deployment arrangement and the resources to, to, to be deployed to a higher level now. And um, as we did before, and we want to reiterate that we will do the same thing, we will remain neutral, we will remain professional, we will never allow our officers um, to cite anybody or any group of people. But for us to be able to do that, we need to work with the civil society organization because you'll be the watchdogs, even the press, will be the watchdogs to see what is happening and then reporting it immediately. And also in the area of uh, um, training before the election, which we put in place, we want you to also be involved in it um, so that collectively we will 
defeat those people that want to create problems uh, during the election. So I decided to call for this meeting so that we will discuss in depth how we shall collaborate and work together as a one unit uh, for the two elections, especially the one in Edo. Thank you. I think it's going to be a closed-door discussion. It is. Thank you. Yes.